Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Nikki. Um, today I wanted to do um, a quick product review slash first impressions try on with um, a mascara by Maybelline called Last Sensational Firework. Um, this is their new mascara in the lineup. And um, if you like me, you like makeup, you know everybody's talking about this mascara everyone seems to like it um i haven't seen too many reviews i've been staying away because i knew i was going to pick this up and try it um so a little bit about me before i open this up and try it um i really like mascara um i'm very particular about what kind of mascara um i try and keep because i do wear glasses and i do have sensitive sensitive easy irritated eyes um i've tried the whole false lashes thing and they don't really work for me because i think my eyes um are too sensitive for the glue and i've tried different glues i've tried different lashes i've tried different ways to put them on and they just irritate my eyes so i've just stuck with um washable mascara similar to this um, I, it just seems like they don't mess with my eyes. Um, I try to go for formulas that are lightweight. They don't flake on the eyes. They don't clump up like little spider legs. Um, they have definition and possibly curl. Um, I have long straight lashes. Not too much of a curl, but I have long straight lashes. Um, I do sometimes curl my lashes, but a lot of times I'm lazy and I just don't. And today's one of those days. Um, on a normal day, I don't curl my lashes when I'm wearing mascara. Um, that's just something extra that I do if I feel like doing it. Um, so I look for if it's going to flake um, or rub off. Um, I look for um, can it do the work within one to two coats. If I have to keep going over it two, three, four times, to me, that is a bad mascara, in my opinion. I shouldn't have to run the brush no more than two times in my um, lashes. And that means putting the wand back into the tube and running it through, so that's two times. Um, so that's what I'll be looking for. Um, although this is not a wear test, um, I will be wearing the mascara all day. And I'll probably leave a pinned comment or something in the description box. Let you guys know how it wore throughout the day. So this is what it looks like. It is the Firework Mascara by Maybelline. And I have it in the color brownish black. Um, I want to go for like a light color versus a dark color. It's just something I wanted. And this is the uh, washable mascara. I do not get um, waterproof mascara because... I've noticed that it does hurt my eyes, so I get washable mascara. So let's open this up and we're going to take a look at the wand. Okay, so this is the product. It's very pretty and it has like these little grooves on the side. So let's look at the wand. As I understand, the wand is flexible and um, these are the bristles. And the wand is flexible. And I'm not putting that much force. It is just bouncing off the um, container, which is good. So I'm going to take off my glasses and I'm going to do one eye. Okay, so I'm going to get ready to apply it on my right eye. Okay, first thing I can say, I really like this wand, and I like the formula. It's not, um,
it's not something that um that is in a lot of drugstore mascaras um it seems pretty light so there's the right eye and this is the left eye with no mascara so there it is it looks really really good and as you notice i haven't had to dip back into the tube so for me this is one coat um i'm going to move you guys in so you can see a little closer So that's my right eye with the mascara and this is my left eye without the mascara. As you can see my lashes look very full, look very long and they actually are curled on the ends and I did not curl them. This is my left eye and this is my right eye with the mascara. So I'm going to do the other eye and I'll be right back. Okay, so I did both eyes, and I have my glasses on, and I can honestly say that this formula feels very comfortable. Um, I've had it on for about two minutes now, and I don't see any flaking. Um, my lashes aren't like spider webbing out, um, and I don't see any clumping. And for this to be a brown black shade, it looks pretty dark. I really like it. One thing I can say, my left eye, my left lashes are always hard to apply mascara. And um, it's always hard to curl. Um, I don't know if because I'm right handed and it's hard for me to maneuver my left eye. Um, I can definitely say that this wand really helped to get into um every space in my lashes um both eye only has one coat of mascara i did not have to dip the wand back into the tube for a second or third coat each eye has one coat and it looks absolutely pretty i really really like this um i think my favorite thing is that it is a lightweight um even with my glasses on, I can't feel the mascara. There are a lot of formulas out there, even high-end formulas that I paid a lot of money for. The formula is so heavy and so thick that uh, it clumps up my lashes. And when I put my glasses on, it has all this residue on my glasses. Um, and I'm not getting that whatsoever. I'm not getting it. And it's been, I don't know, five or so minutes. And my lashes look great so i'm going to wear this all day long and i will leave a pinned comment or something in the description box to let you guys know um how this wore all day um i can tell you this is a great drugstore product i really really like this um for all of my ladies who love mascara and spend 40 50 90 dollars on mascara i really think you should check out more drugstore um to me mascara is one of those products that has to be replaced often because it dries out quickly um so i don't pay no more than drugstore prices um drugstore has really upped their game in the last couple of years and i'm very happy to see that very very excited about this mascara um i actually picked up mine from amazon you can get it from any drugstore now Walmart, Target, CVS, Walgreens, any drugstore, any online retailer that sells it. Um, they have different colors, um, black, this is brown, black. They also have, I think, a regular brown. Um, check it out. It's really awesome. Um, thank you guys for watching, and I'll be back with another video very, very soon.